Hello, Ms. Burgess Sweeney in Trinity College. Over the past half of the year, the Wethersfield police, you know, they've been, they confessed to switching names and forging names and switching sequences with more names. In other words, our roles with that, with their own, calling my house. There are a whole bunch of people from my street got involved with Wethersfield police families, retired and standing, other police forms, former director of the FBI in his defendant capacity, federal criminals associated with him. McCord confessed and Mr. confirmed involved with an untimely death on and off Trinity College in Hartford, as ones in Wethersfield that were also coordinated roles with predicate acts, allusions, note, on and off Central Connecticut State University. NBC Connecticut News and other Connecticut news people also attached me to fake words and conversations with themselves and doctors, including a Leahy family further involved with the principal child abusers campus at the time. And there's a Joshua Julian, a Josh, that's a Joshua Julian further on Facebook pages involved with them. They've been starting fights with people and, they, and they've been at the same time speaking fake lies and sequence shifts and identity thefts and speaking to people like they had a conversation with them, like Joshua Julian, Julian, I never had anything to do with them. There's a Rick C.M. Faglione and there's a Tim O'Brien I had nothing to do with them the entire time they went through high school, and they, they, they were involved with with the name uh, uh, with one of the people with the name Kololo. There's also a Phil Kololo that a uh, Bob Chase brought up, and he testified in court he was to show me a police report. These people wrote falsified police reports, charged me with harassment, fabricated audio and video, and switched it from phone conversations. Also, because the guy left a whole bunch of messages on my answering machine. The principal child abuser, before that was caught, they forced that and not to be told on. They put me with a, a huge bond, six months. These are people that wrote falsified police reports since I was a kid, wouldn't put anything in writing. I can't get a response and counter them. Um, they also attached me to fake conversations with themselves. Two Mendez police. There are people, that a whole bunch of people said that there's there are people with the name, um, um, I forgot the names, but there's a there's a Joshua Stryker, that's a, if that's his real name. But he from people from Weathersfield recorded. I never had any class for me. Wasn't my my grade. He's involved with people with the houses next to the the state judicial branch offices. Also, on off body dumping spots that EMS and and and, and doctors foreign and domestic have involvements with where where they have child abuses of juxtaposed natures relevant. So there's also a Dean Alfred that they forged, forced, tricked, hurt, and persuaded to switch names or to switching names roles. He might not also, he also might not be aware of that. But most of the people that are aware of things, they are only aware through lie progressions. And they've been getting coached by the judges and prosecutors that got involved criminally, where they just stick up for pe for the police force. The, the, the name switching and forging is, 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 is in individually grouped and together. They have acts and methods of it. The police forms that are involved switching names with that. They also have that with the, with the courts. And they have grouped methods of doing that because that prevents people from speaking while they are stacking more audio and video fabrications into the databases. They are making more, um, quote, experts, unquote, speak opinions and convictions and with physical delusions and as federal rules crimes at predators against other people and, and so they keep it they're keeping up this game like this they even have the the, the fire the the fire departments and the the um, police forms roles with the with the private policing of the campuses and the, you know all, all the programs are messed up they have they have they have mayors and their kids involved hiding in backgrounds please get them onto the paper with the three with, with with the judges from the Britain Superior Court and Hartford courts criminally involved and with the people who pretend they had conversations with me. I, I, not at all. They pretended the huge conversations. Three times they brought me for, uh, they forced me for a mental evaluation at Hartford Hospital with some doctors and police forms recorded, confessed, demonstrated, confirmed, involved with untimely deaths with people in my area. That also brought up the principal child's abusers campus to me. That's why I called there. So Dean Ber uh, Berger, uh, President Berger, please, Berger Sweeney, please make sure that they, I get them onto paper because they attach me to fake writing letters too. 
these are the same. There's a whole bunch of names too, like you know, and there and there are other untimely deaths that were coordinated, and their confessions were coordinated. They were because they had to hide live progression's time from the past, because both political parties are being and having been uh, and were already used remotely. You, you know, with their kids too. There's a former mayor Gold. She wasn't even in my class. She was pretending things with federal criminals and police forms, including former director of the FBI, Robert Luskin, in his defending capacities, and his lawyer, uh, Robert Chevere, is one of the ones involved with predicate acts on and off Trinity College in 2004 and before that, and then since, and then leading up to the 2006 case, and since intercities on and off Fox Connecticut, rule, Connecticut News rules with predicate acts, lying to the federal judges, you know, and they also have the ad company placements. There's also an Iowa family recorded confessed and confirmed involved with various natures of, of gun crimes and threats with the police forms on my street involved with this. See, the ones that answer the police for the for the for the for the phones for the police through time, their families have with fire departments or other countries, they have roles with drugs where they're allowed to do that. But they've been using that. And their, and their roles with the prisons, too, kept needing to hide the same lies and sequence shifts and crimes that caught them with with their patients and criminals before they were in their in their custody. And with the same uses of identity ground locations, offensive evidence reception, um, corruption, and worse than that was is used remotely by that which was sophistication here since before our founding parents were born. How, they, how dare anyone, too, make people... Uh, you know, you know, not use how our founding parents wanted us to explain how no, how slavery was still entrenched north and south, and right up to the last part of the Civil War, there was a breaching method that everyone was blaming what it was causing on other things, others and ourselves, even when that was correctly, and then but they were defending that for the long term. That's what everyone's stuck in too. So they have they have this game at the at the campuses where they've been fabricating audio and video. And they, they've been coaching the people who answer the phones to pretend they don't understand what I said. They have a New Britain Superior Court with a, with a, a number of... Uh, well, they have one of them that made a rape threats, K-N-E-R-R. They have a number of Facebook pages with a K-N-E-R-R. These are also people that work for Facebook that, and, and, and that are involved with... The, you know, these are FBI and CIA and their, and their family members. There are foreign and domestic military, Kuwaiti... Saudi, I can't get a response from any of them. They have, they have, you know, they have involvements intercities with with relevant predicate acts and wrongdoing. And the news media attached me to fake words about the World Trade Center. They have confessions about that since I was in high school. They used to make confessions to me when I come around a corner after I would be called to an office or something like that. You see, former director, they have uh, our agencies when there were corruption known. This is since. Back in the day when they when they had the transition from Aka to Rico, these are also people involved with the locations next to Trinity and next to CCSU, involved with the police forms and the courts and their family members, and, and the fire departments and their family members, involved with identity thefts and frauds, is one of the things commonly, all the different little instances, roles, and, and fake instances, too. Since I was a kid, so they're tied, they were brought up. As the people playing these games with the wire crimes with 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 the police, forbid in the courts for forbidding me writing to respond to, because once they once they put right they they sent me one thing it was fake conversations, that I, I wrote again I said let me get a response, I haven't gotten a response. Now these are ones with their kids and the, that that had these are doctors, that had kids in the campus and one that was living next to her. she might have moved or not I don't know, but these are people also with the with the news media through time when it's involved with this. this is a, these are these are some sick people with the, the institute of living and with other um the policing of other harford medical campuses that are also involved with child abuses and and, and sexual abuses of men, women and uses of kkk confederate flag theme and black themed military police officers and their family members in the religious roles with the religious locations and with stores and things like that, parks and stuff, and with the uh, um, you know, you know, with, with the spots. Of, in other words, the the they're rather than have me speak about all these things and and search them out and tell about why because they it shows 
they, every, they have to hide lies in the background. So they've been offensively committing more predicate acts of wrongdoing because they, they're, they're little fakes. They grew up little fakes with the ones in the other cities tied to my interbranch from Wethersfield because they're victim predators. So they, so they need to respond to me why they haven't responded to about the uh, untimely deaths roles and confessions regarding the names. There's a name Scalora further recorded, confessed, and demonstrated as one of the houses near the near the near near, near the principal child abuser's school, and they told lies about me to people on that street. I know because I don't care if people lie, whatever. But, but when it comes on to the, it's the exceptions. You know what I mean? They not, now they have falsified police reports, with fake conversations with me. They had people make statements to me in other cities. As the people, that's how they get, they get it, people involved. And they use the news media with this. So they have a Dean Alford forging and switching names. They're trying to pull in the identity of Trinity. They have, a, they have an officer that used the name Darth Vader, also involved with this. And a whole bunch of people with the name Sullivan and O'Sullivan. And they were spying on a girl and her boyfriends. And one of them was apparently involved with those spying on me. And they lied. They attached me and her and everyone to fake words, fake sequence relationships. The switching names is part of it. The, you know, so please get have a response for Dean Alford. Was that a Dean Alford? There's a, there's a, there's a, so again, there are, there are judges and FBI and the people that work for their courts. Their family members were also involved with the recorded confess, demonstrate, confirmed, having been coordinated on and off Trinity College in Hartford, Connecticut. And in New Britain, Connecticut, CCSU, federal crimes, as people rolls also with, with federal crimes, with the grammar schools and with the, with the middle school and with the high school I went to. Now, the middle school also has a Dr. Graham who, who, and has a, 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 a Bob Chase also involved with a Phil Colola, who's one of the uh, cousins uh, of one of the people with the last name, Colola, that... Um, and Officer Sullivan, who was a man, said he was his name was Officer Sullivan from Weathersfield Town Offices. Then I called. Then I called back, confirmed they confirmed, they confirmed it was Officer, but he's using another officer's name because they only have one officer named Sullivan. It's a woman. See, they've been switching and also stacking names to make people sound like they they don't um make sense when they talk because they've been putting since I was a kid fake things into databases. They recorded, confessed, demonstrated, confirmed there was a there's a there are others from my town who used my name crib and pretended to know me. They try to like, take pictures standing next to you or whatever like that. There's an Eric Oliveri also involved with UPS with shipping drugs. And then with, with, with all, they use the confessions to strangers because of his roles with the Weathersfield police and other police forms and, the, and overt criminal enterprises involved on my street with the fact cheap nature oriented narratives, illusions roles and uses of my name roles. And their roles with Facebook is completely recorded. They've been fabricating audio and video with New Britain, Connecticut News, and with the police forums. And we with the news is together, too, how they played softball together, was recorded, confessed, demonstrated, confirmed, involved with, you know, also mm, religious locations and election locations. The election lies recorded a phrase being used to, for worse than just sequence shift cover-ups and screening of what, actually was and is an insurrection method and since and our founders wanted us to explain how locations areas and states were left criminally foreign influenced north and south and how we were really going to have to counter slavery the, the, new york city is there are fifty thousand. there are countless examples of how slavery you know we have to have hyper definition we have to have hyper truth please Burge Sweeney, please get them onto paper. This this Dean Alford, the one who spoke for him. This is we're going to deal with this. Everyone's individual involvement because these people in Hartford are recording that with the with the with the grammar school that still didn't talk to me. They have sustained medical sexual abuse. Even the doctors involved with their patients and criminals since before they got caught. These people also pretend to people are having hate after they bring up. The, 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 their sexual orientations and things and their their theaters and lies with with and to others and uses of locations. I don't know Mike Roberts either. They went out of their way to make exceptions with the only exceptions 
and that's recorded, confessed, and demonstrated, confirmed, involved with people all along Route 3 in Wethersfield, uh, trying to pretend other with them, and with the names involved, and with my town's police chief, of Sintron, and his, his daughter. You see, that made it worse, and a whole bunch of people tied to them with the courts personally criminally involved with them, and like a, like a Jonathan Maiano. And, and, you know, these people sought me out, and they also had them for sequence shifts where I didn't, you know, no, so I just established those truths because they're going to, it's something to do with the, there's connections between the people on my street that were involved with the ones on Trinity College and on CCSU that coordinated identity thefts and frauds instances. And there were uses of it when I was in those departments with relevant confessions and stuff like this is leading up to the World Trade Center and since intercities tied since I was a little kid too. And it was sickly distinctly right before the World Trade Center attack. And me and others involved with it were in, were in the Ninth Circuit Court right next to, uh, right, right next to the um, World Trade Center right before the attack. And proven after the attack, right before the attack, they had presented post-dated documents. They, they had time, they had time stamped them post dated to appear late to the judges right before the World Trade Center attack. So it took all kind of time for that, excuse me. And that led up to a 2006 district court case in Connecticut, the one that had been part of a case slash S in Manhattan. Then it became part of a case slash S in, in Connecticut in a district court case in 2006. That's with, there were people associated, there are police that recorded, confessed, demonstrated, confirmed, attached the defendants and the prosecutor, I mean the defendants and the plaintiffs to, to fake words and, and as their roles with predicate acts against me and the little kids I caught them doing this with. The parents don't even know, the parents have been lied to. It has something to do with like the, the military police that, that are involved with other f f uh, countries. And they have little kids that like would make all stories together and they, they had connections because they know, okay, these people, they never saw, knew each other the first year. You know, they don't know, they're not going to know, they're seeing this person. They're making a theater fake. They're needing, a, they're making everyone need to hide live progressions. Also, per what I caught them doing with the, with the grammar schools. And I found out afterwards, it was what they were doing with the other schools, the, even the youngest grades. They need to do this. They put they put little things in there because it makes syntax. It makes you know they th they have all kind of sick ways of keeping the quality of fact cheating nature, leaving out how our locations, areas, and states were left by our founders to demonstrate criminally for influence and used remotely. I'm I cannot tell a lie. We're speaking when they have been lying where they can't, and but they pretend they have the right to. See Marbury versus Madison. They they need to respond for me. Since I was a kid, they wouldn't put anything in writing. They would just put charges and, and make confessions that, 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 that and how the police reports were consciously fabricated. They've been attaching me since I was a kid and others to fake locations, fake words, fake ties to themselves, fake natures of ties to themselves, fake ties to others, fake natures of ties to others. That's a, a lot of impositions, and, and they, they also have physical delusions that I will delineate with their criminal natures. That's juxtaposed. That's also in the way of, of um, you know, sensible speech and behavior that's proper. So they're, they're, they're lying about, they're involved with behavior racketeering.